MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are... Okay, MJ, I'm back. Did I miss the ceremony? Tony? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. that I have to correct. I'm not full of anger. I'm full of love. I call out injustice, corruption, and crimes against humanity because I adore this city. And I want it to be better. What you hear in my voice, it's love. Nothing but love! There's the sage entrance, and we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. <laughs> well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider-Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> Or, maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so... so? I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery. Above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer.
I need to get around somehow. Right there.
Dad was right there. Gotta help him. I got you, Dad. to leave now. I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around.
Okay, that's all of them. Oh, high security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Looks like I could override the circuit. I need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. Uh-huh. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the explosives from Fisk's construction site. Truck bombs? This is crazy. Guns from Fisk's armory. And lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. This wasn't a gang war. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef. With Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their... Consolidated shipping. A lot of guys.
He's not out here. Better check inside. Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. What else can I find around here? They have bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. Expecting, but it was definitely not this. Hey, MJ, I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign offices. Nice. Did you find Lee? No, but I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Ride. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. Silverbird, we're descending to location. There's another one. Safety's off. Well, this is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a. Hey! That's not how we do things. Down! Down! Code SM1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this. Who the hell are you guys? Code SM1. Code SM1. Holding for orders. Copy code SM1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverburn. Nice entrance. Solid 8 out of 10. Nine out of 10. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. <laughs> 